This is really weird being in front of a camera. This is like, this is my on the camera face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Kimmy Walker and I'm owner and designer at Sirius Beads. I started making these collars for my dogs and I wanted something that was really sturdy, um, clean, practical, and useful for every day and most importantly was comfortable for my dogs. I didn't want anything that chafed their skin and the best thing I could find were stones. I choose to work mostly with all natural stones, um, some carved, some handmade artisan beads, and um, all of the collars are handmade exactly to your dog's size and specifications. So it's exactly the perfect collar for your dog. I love flinging out dogs. I love making them look good. I love making owners feel good and bringing a little joy into everybody's lives. In order to support my collar business and my collar habit, I am also a full-time educator, a teacher. So for me, it's natural to want to teach and learn about things and especially show loads. And I'm an active member of the breed community and I really enjoy doing breed education booths, meetups. I love advocating for the breed. Um, in fact, just today, meeting some people, riding a ferry in Seattle, um, getting to share about the breed was one of the most joyful moments of the day. Um, and seeing the joy in people's faces as they learn about this incredible dog um, really, really makes my heart full. I think the biggest gift um, and one of the most incredible things about Sholos is the people that they've brought into my life, the people that I've gotten to share with, the people that I've gotten to learn with, and connecting with the community. And I've been able to do that um, through several venues, not just locally here around Seattle, but also all over the world. Washington, Pacific Northwest, Europe, Mexico, lots of different places where people love Sholos, love the breed, and are working towards ways to encourage more ethical practices that will support and preserve the Sholos um, so that they will be a healthy and well taken care of breed, not just for me right now, but for lots of generations in the future. Having this network and community of people who share similar morals values and ethics to support and preserve um, this breed, to preserve the Sholos, gives me a lot of hope and it makes me feel um, like part of a community that really cares about the dogs and wants to learn and grow with them. I am also learning and growing and um, will continue to do so. If you want to follow my journey and my dogs and my collars, um, Sirius Beads and Sirius Sholos will link them in the comments below. So the genesis story of um, kind of connecting with Sholos Supply, uh, Julio had put up a post about like, what do you guys think you want? Like, what should we do next? And just jokingly, like no expectations, did not expect anything. I was like, hey, meet up in Seattle. And literally like a minute later, Huli was like, sure, let's do it. <laughs> so here we are two years later on our second big Pacific Northwest solo meetup. And our turnout was amazing. Um, talking about connecting with the community and really filling people's hearts with love and learning. And one of the participants who came with their dog, uh, best quote ever, says, um, please let this be what heaven is like. And I agree. <laughs>